Right, so I think I want to start like vlogging more honestly, so I'm gonna kind of, you know, start off I guess with this week. So this is like week three of this training cycle. About to head to bed, it's actually quite late, so I'm gonna try and do this like relatively quickly, but but yeah, week three, so doing some heavy singles on power cleans and squats. It was really fun training today. Everything was moving quite well. You know, weights, you know, I did like 99 kilos for a single on power clean. It moved like very well compared to, you know, how similar weights have moved in the past. And then 130 on squats flew up as well. So really good day. Looking forward to hopefully testing the maxes next week. You know, I'm not sure maybe John's not going to program the maxes, but I am feeling really good, feeling like way stronger than what I have been. So just looking forward to it. I guess that's really all I've got to say. But yeah, I think I'll try and vlog the training. I don't know if people want me to vlog like every day. Like I can vlog the Tuesdays and Thursdays, but they're kind of like, like the exercises are just kind of very basic and more recovery oriented. It's oriented, so it's like, you know, like body weight stuff, maybe like basic barbell stuff, but I can maybe include some of that in like the vlogs in the future. But I think for this week, I'll just do like the main days of like Monday, Wednesday, Friday, and then Saturday jump day as well. So that's the plan. But yeah, I'm going to go and head to bed now because it is late. So back to get a minute, man.
Right, so I've just finished up a dunk session there. So I guess I'll, I guess I'll kind of recap the, the last, well, yesterday and today. So yesterday I had like, I was like really sleep deprived for like the past two days. I didn't really get great sleeps and I was feeling really kind of like fried and fuzzy after doing like all my training for the day. So I technically did like two speed and power sessions or like speed and explosive sessions. So I had my sprints in the morning, six times 30. Those went really well. I'm really making great progress with, you know, sprinting with better technique. So looking forward to transitioning that to longer sprints now. But we had in, so in class I do sports and exercise science at uni. We were testing some maxes, uh, not maxes, but like standing counter movement jump, like hands on hip squat jump, hands on hip counter movement jump single leg hands on hip right leg hands on hip it was like three of each and then there was like single leg broad jump on each leg and then some five meter sprints so i did like way too much volume for that stuff so i was feeling kind of pretty fried after that and then my strength was like way down when i was training i was struggling to power clean it felt like really inconsistent as well so i think it's definitely probably like just neuromuscular fatigue but 97 and a half i caught that quite well um, and then 102 kilos, I, you know, managed to full clean it at least, but just too slow and getting underneath the bar, so I kind of, you know, the bar crashed on me and forced me into a full squat. But we still kind of cleaned it, which I guess is like, you know, it's better than failing it. So kind of like mission failed successfully on that. And then yeah, today with the dunks, I was originally planning on just doing 15 dunks because I was feeling kind of fried from yesterday, but you know the session one thing led to another got to like 25 jumps maybe possibly a bit more but i was feeling like reasonable enough and i was getting some good 99 attempts so i thought why not just like vep out a little bit and get some you know motor patterns built up i still just think my lobs are just really bad so that's like probably the biggest thing it'd probably be better if i had someone lobbing up for me i feel like i'd probably get more consistent dunks off two feet at least if i had that but, but yeah just gotta kind of work with what i've got but yeah, got a close left hand dunk first, two hand dunk off two feet on nine, five and a half. And it might even be my highest two hand dunk I've ever done. Not really 100% sure, but that was like accidental. And then yeah, I got some two like fake dunks when the ball's like already going in, but you like push it in with your hand. Call those kind of fake dunks. So, so yeah, it's been a reasonable, you know, reasonable week of training. Monday was definitely feeling really good and strong. So I think next week will be test week, so max non power clean and back squat on Monday hopefully. So that should be good fun. Just kind of see where I'm at with those. But yeah, I think that's about it. So thank you for watching my week of training.